Welcome back to the Outer Worlds. Last video, we cleaned up the back bays. Got a couple side quests cleaned up. I think that's the back bays down there because it even looks like it from when we were down there. Because there's the elevator to get down there right there. So that kind of looks like it. And uh, that. Uh, Let's see, that cleared up a couple jobs here. Comes now with the power. No, not that one. Oh man, are these in some kind of order here? No, I guess not. Uh, hmm. Where are they? Or maybe it doesn't put quests down here yet? Or side quests? Who goes there? Yeah, this guy. We took this guy down. And we helped uh, Jule fix. Well, we haven't turned that in yet, that's why. This one up here. Happiness is a warm space. We haven't turned that one in yet. Decided we would do that in this video. But unfortunately, the whack job that I am, after I sold all that stuff off, I kind of went shopping and then I wandered into a rabbit hole, which is the waste disposal area. I should have recorded this, but I didn't. We're going to go through it anyway and show you what I found. Not much. There's a place here. Go. And these uh, little areas are just, you know, cool places to discover. Like I said, I should have just recorded this. This here takes you out above the promenade. Nope, not that one, this one. And there's a guy over there. We can deal with him in a minute. Let's see. This here takes you out above the promenade. You can walk this set of pipes. There's a little little box over there full of stuff. Um, nothing fantastic, but stuff. Um, and then going this way, that's where we came from. We'll get to you in a minute. This door here is barred when you come here, so you can't go that way. So you can go this way. This is full of sprats. Oh, no, no, wait. This was a new enemy, Manta Pillars. There was three of them in here. We had to kill those. So now we're on the other side of the barred door, but I came from over here anyway. So there's three Manta Pillars in here. We whacked them. This guy got his stuff. We got the boxes. There's some stuff here. Did I get this guy? I did. We got all this stuff. I didn't get this stuff here. This goes outside again. I didn't really investigate this too much. I don't know what's this way. Let's go. I if there's anything over here. Let's see. I don't really know what's over here. Uh oh. Same place? The Manta Pillars? Yeah, same place. Okay, so there's nothing out there. You go here. And you go this way instead of this way where that guy's whining and crying. You go this way. There is a ladder here. It's kind of hard to get on. You got to go backwards. You go down here. And it's a storeroom. I don't know which place this is. What does it say? The last hag's bar. Okay, so this is the back room to the bar, and you can pilfer all their stuff. I didn't notice my reputation go down at all while I did all this, but so just a bunch of stuff in here. I left all the the health products and food products or whatever. I just took all the all the goodies, ammo and such. 
right? So that's that place. And then, let's see, where else did I go? There's another, uh, another place here somewhere before you rescue this guy. Where is it? There's a way into the uh, weapons dealer's armory. Where is that? I knew I was going to forget something because I was wandering around here. This is out, this goes out, right? That goes outside. And let's see where we are. I might be able to figure it out if I know where we are. This here. Okay. The armory's over there. She's on that side. Right next to the entrance to this place. Let's see. Yeah, I didn't want to deal with this guy just yet. I figured we'd deal with him on camera. What's this? That's the bar? That's the bar, which is this one. So we got to go to another place somewhere. Let's see. How do I get out of here? Here we go. This might be it here. No, this is how we got up originally, I think. Let's see. Where just drops us off at here. This one. This is full of sprats. Rabid sprats. Not good sprats. Rabid sprats. There's a few things in here. Not much. You wind your way through here. Takes you to another area right here. I believe this is the Armory, the, the weapons dealer. Can't remember her name. Now, she has a bunch of stuff in here you can take, and there was a weapon here, which I just took it, sold it. Did I sell it? Let's see. I think it was this heavy machine gun I picked up in here. So I do have some more stuff to sell. I picked up a heavy machine gun in here. So, and I also discovered that I got what's-his-name's weapon, the guy we killed, which, yeah, I didn't keep it. It's an energy weapon, and it's one of those weapons that won't fire on anything until there's something in the crosshairs. Okay, so this is the weapons dealer's back room. We can sneak, we can go out here, get some XP for unlocking this, but I don't think it's cool to just kind of walk out of someone's locker storeroom. So that's all the stuff I discovered off camera. I just forgot about this little area. I think there's going to be a mission or two that takes you back here again, but we're here now. All right, so we can go. This takes you out, and I'll show you the weapons dealer. She's right here. Not the, This is her right here. What's it called? Bell Shells. That's her warehouse right there, her little storeroom. Let's go back and talk to the guy in the cracker. Because he's basically stuck there. Oh yeah, this is the this is the uh, trash compactor, I guess. <laughs> or whatever. These are... These sprats won't hurt you. They're friendly sprats. A couple boxes down there. Let's see what's in those. I hope there's friendly, all friendly sprats. I don't know. I didn't see nothing in the... Oh, here we go. What do we got here? Examine. Crap. Cranky got a lead on some local salvage. One of the groundbreakers, old hangers, was bricked over until someone found it by poking around the what quarters? The south of quarters. Lila gave the go ahead to plant her flag once we clear out the new arrivals. I'm sending you to scout. 
look for a good loose panel. You've got to climb on top of the bulks and head toward the back wall. Layla says we should watch out, watch our backs. She thinks we're being trailed. In other words, Trust. Oh, typical Lila. Okay. I think I already got this. That was when I was trying to get the prismatic hammer and I was jumping all over the place over there. I don't think there's a. Uh, oh, I didn't see anything pop up for that. We already got that. We were in the. Uh, let's see, we come in here. This way, right over here, we were jumping around on top of the security place. That's where that's at. Passage to anywhere. We're not doing that. We want to do June Lay. We got to get her hooked up. This one. Hook that one up. All right. I don't think I'll take part of out of here. I was going to do that before, but I said I was going to do that. Uh oh, that spreads out. Because uh, I think June Lay's got a couple other things for us to do first. And then we'll bring Parvati over there and let her talk to her. Now let's go stuck, talk to the guy that's stuck in the toilet. Where's he at? This way. Thank you, stranger. Dude. Shit. Ain't that a relief? Shit. Shit, he said. All right, what? You have dude? no idea how good the air on Groundbreaker smells until you've been trapped in a tiny bathroom with an overflowing toilet. Thanks again, friend. How long were you in there? What happened? How long were you in there? I did you a favor. What are you going to do for me? Let's do this one. You're going to shake me down after I was trapped in a shit covered bathroom? Yep. Is that how it is? Yep. You gonna pay up? Or are you going to stand here smelling like shit? Fine. Here's every bit I've got. That enough for you? Or do you want my shit covered clothes as well? <laughs> Keep your pants on. Don't forget me. I'm considering the possibilities. What do you say? Don't tempt me. I'm considering the possibilities. <laughs> I will. I will preserve my dignity. No one can take that away from me. Okay, so that was all that was all about. Alright, so let's go... Uh, um, where, how do we get out of here again? I gotta go this way. This the right way? He'll follow me if it is. Yeah, it is. Um, no, it's not. Is it? Yeah, I guess it is. Okay. No. It's not that way. This way. Alright, let's go talk to Jun Lei in engineering. Have you seen this man? I don't know why they got these freaking blast doors here. Alright. Do I have my, uh, I didn't even have my Persuade outfit on. I should have had it on. I probably could have shaked that guy down more. Let's put it on. This one. Dialogue outfit. Dialogue. And Persuade. Looking good. Alright, here we go. You've returned. And in one piece. Color me impressed. Okay. I've got the parts for your radiators. What now? What's it like being commander? Uh, see, I don't really want to get into a whole lot of conversations. You don't have a lot of faith in the board. All right, I got your parts. Good work. I'll take those. I need you to head through the large door at the far end of engineering. Take the elevator down into the machinery shop. There's a terminal in the back. Activate it when I call over the ship's PA. And bring weapons. There's a slight man to pillar infestation. 
define slight. More than a few. Less than a hive. Nothing <laughs> you can't handle. We were salvaging parts from a ship. Turned out there were eggs inside. They got into the radiators, and here we are. I got your parts. Why do I have to do the maintenance stuff? If every repair was a one-woman job, I wouldn't need an engineering team. As it is, my staff is busy keeping the station from melting down. You can flip a switch for me, but you can't install these parts. Not quickly, at least. Not on the first try. Able, though, you've proven to be. All right. Yeah, that's how I was thinking. She wanted us to do something else. Is this... What is this? What's the lock on this? Oh, that's her key card, which is... I think I'd have to hide steal that from her if I want it. Well, let's see. If I do her a favor, maybe I'll be all right. She said, go down... Where? I have to put my armor back on or my sneak. <clears throat> Where the hell have you been, Private? You've missed three shifts without noticing. <laughs> I was fixing that toilet you sent me to repair. The one above the lost hope? That was days ago. <laughs> Where do I have to go? This way? Oh yeah, this way. Okay, I'm set up. Manta pillars. Got elevator music here. Cool. All right, so do a quick save right here. These guys are usually pretty good, pretty easy to kill with plasma. We just gotta get them. You don't need to, I need to. Where are they all? Is there one up there? A few here. Can't get a beat on any of them, eh? They're hiding behind all these boxes and stuff. Come on, dude. There's one. Can't see me. How can they see me? Come on. Really, with one shot, wouldn't get them, huh? Where is it? It's a swarm, I can't see it. Come on, man, kill that thing. I hate swarms. Alright, where's the rest of them now? Let's do a quick save. Let's go with, uh, not that. Let's try my, I don't need the prismatic hammer. That's the one I don't need right now. So let's do, let's get rid of this. Where is my assault rifle? Plasma rifle. This is what we want. Let's do this. This usually does a pretty good job on them. Gotta pick another one off. Let's do a quick save again since I switched weapons. So I don't have to do that again. Alright, where's the next one? There's one up there, but I can't see him. Can't get a beat on him. Oh, there's two up there. But oh, no, just one right there. Maim. Get up, dude. Get 
He gonna come for me? He's mad. Oh, my world for a hand grenade. There he is. No, can't see him. There he is. Did I get him? I did. I don't know if that's all or not, but we're gonna find out. Let's put on my plasma rifle. Quick save. Don't tell me this is Mark Steel. All this stuff, and it's all over the ship, and it's Mark Steel. It's like, come on. These guys aren't giving up anything, are they? But oh, we gotta go upstairs. Let's make sure. Nothing there. More? Yeah, we'll get a chance to test out the plasma rifle here. What kind of damage does this kick out? No! Sooner or later I'm going to get used to the buttons here. This is kicking out 48 damage. Nope, more than that. 59 to 134. We can do some damage with this. Let's see if there's anything around here first before we go in there. Doesn't look like it. Ow. Really? Too close to something, huh? Oh, good. Bag picks. You can always use those. Alright, here we go. Let's see what's in here. Bad news? Diagnostic says their circuit boards are fused from the heat, so they're not too picky about who they kill next. So now we gotta do. Shoot back if you need to. I can always fix them later. So now we gotta do frickin' mechanicals. So that should really require my shock weapon. Where's that at? Is this it? Assault rifle ham. Yeah. in a room, which I have to go through the room, it looks like. Okay. One of these doors locked. Let's see. Okay, let's go the other way. Let's see what's on this side. Yeah, there's one right here, it looks like. Oh, no. That one's barred. Okay, so I gotta go this way. Forcing me to go one direction, eh? Okay. Still can't one-shot these guys. It's getting a little difficult. I need a better weapon. Well, or just keep continuing to tinker these up a little bit. All right, boys, where are you? Show your mechanical selves. What are these guys? A gland. Okay, all right. See, that's where I came in. So I have to go down the other side, huh? What's this? Oh, here he is. Okay. Let's put my small guns helmet on. Or handguns? Oh, not handguns. I thought I had small. Yeah, I gotta get rid of that handguns one. That's just... I mean, it works, but I don't, you know, it's kind of very specific. Uh, 
Let's go this way. I could get these guys with the hammer too if I wanted to. Guys, is a drone, I think, right? No, he's not a drone. He's a drone, okay. Alright, uh. Means we gotta go down somewhere, probably right here, eh? Let's double check our surroundings first. But it looks like that's the way to go. There's only one way down, right? Okay. Let's go this way. Quick save. <clears throat> so we gotta get the drone first. Those are the most vicious things. Oh, a couple more boxes here. Empty boxes? What the hell? That's the terminal. I have the parts in position on my side. Go ahead and cycle the droplet pump. Oh, sure. In and a moment. Know what that means, just look for a command that says, cycle droplet. This guy here, he's the guy that's trouble. Head off. Cool. Yeah. He's got nothing. And where'd the little drone guy go? There he is. Pile of dust, he's got nothing. This has got nothing. Uh, another mod. Should be overflowing with mods. I need some weapons to put them on. Alright, we're gonna use this. And what does it say? Cycle. I'll just do this. Generators. Happiness is a warm ship. Turn to Jute Lay. The temperatures are dropping. Stop by once you found your way out of there. Groundbreaker owes you things. Okay. And I think everybody mentions it too if you talk to people on the groundbreaker and oh you're the one that fixed the the heat problem, huh? Nice. This must be the way here, yep. Take the elevator back. Oop. There was a workbench down here, wasn't there? I think I, I think off camera I tinkered up all my weapons again. I went back to the ship and tinkered up all my weapons. What's this? What's on here? Logs and transmissions. Something logs and transmissions. It's just it's too small. I'm nuts. Arrowhead? I don't know. Let's see what it says. Uh, 
Okay. Well, I will just destroy that trying to read it. So we'll just leave it there and you can read it if you want. Pause the video. Because I can't really read it. It's just too small for me. Just for a better understanding of why I do this on a big screen TV and I kind of just sit back away from it. It's not a computer screen, so. It can be kind of tedious to try to read this stuff sometimes. As long as there's nothing, nothing popped up that says you got a new mission, so we're good. Mantis Swarm. Now, you know, where did a Mantis Swarm come from? I thought they only come from the big Mac Daddies. I forgot what they're called. Uh, Mantis, uh... I don't know. We'll see one of them soon enough. They're huge and very hard to kill. In my current capacity, they would be. Okay, that's the ladder going up. All right, let's get out of here. Go get our reward, and then we'll go get Parvati. If we got time, we got to bring Parvati back here so she can talk to Julie and they can make Whoopi over the engineering. Intimidation, just in case. My dialogue suit. In case I need it. I love that helmet. It's kind of cool. Anything I can, anything I can take yet? We interrupt your regularly scheduled advertisement for the following story. Can I take these, please? Uh. What it takes to defend your corporate township from the dangers of alien wildlife and the other stories. Talk to you. I wonder if, do a quick save here. Sneak. Was that gonna take two mag picks? I have 60 mag picks? Really? So we have our little key card now. Um, let me check my mag picks. I didn't realize I had 60 of them. Holy crap. I didn't think so. I can't see. It says 25. I don't know what 60 meant. All right, so we have our key card. Let's go talk to her. Put on my little dialogue suit again here. My hey, I got your stuff. What a weight that is off my shoulders. I don't normally tolerate outsiders mucking about in my station's guts, but you're all right. The temperature should be dropping as we speak. Nice. I'll see to it the crew knows who kept us all from boiling alive. Oh, she thinks. If you've got time, I believe Edna has a comms issue that could use your attention. I've what? also authorized Doc and Furu to sell you our premium meds. Nice. So uh, what's it like? Let's ask her this question. Frustrating. Everything down to the circuit boards is past warranty, so I have the pleasure of making life-or-death decisions on a shoestring budget. Plus, there's no time to train my successor or document fixes in a way that anyone outside the family would understand. This ship is a family? Sure is. The Tennysons came over on the groundbreaking. My grandmother, Chief Gang, kept it together during the crossing and until she died. I was promoted only recently, when my mom died. Hmm. Then I took the leap from chief engineer to captain. See, was it a big change? It was different knowing that I couldn't turn to anyone who could answer the tough questions for me. Maybe you can hmm. see why I'm protective of Groundbreaker. This ship is family. It's got tinkerings and bypasses that only Tennyson's know about. Where's the self-destructive mechanism? <laughs> Aren't you a little young to be training a successor? You see any bite-sized Tennyson children running around? <laughs> I didn't think so. The next captain won't have my heritage. I'll have to foster that talent from somewhere. It's only a question of when. I hope that was a joke, Captain. <laughs> I really do. I gelded that thing years ago. Now it grows a stem that goes down stronger than Nan or Spang. Family recipe. <laughs> you got my attention. 
Uh, let me see, you don't have much, a lot of faith in the board. You're right, I don't. The board is after two things, bits and power, and they only get it by sticking their nose where it doesn't belong. You must not like Udom. I like to think of myself as a nice person, but if that gaudy embassy of his was on fire, I might hold my breath a moment before activating the sprinkler system. <laughs> the board wants control over Groundbreaker, and leeches like Udom Bedford will do anything to please their corporate masters. Why do you keep the board at a safe distance? I placate them when I have something to offer, but I can also be a real hard ass. It'd be a joy if I could kick out the corporate merchants and reclaim the docking fees in my lifetime. Too much of Groundbreaker's income is flowing in the wrong direction. Hmm. I'd like to see that change. You've got my attention. I'm going away. We're gonna go uh, in here. Quick save in case anything bad happens with this. I don't think it will as long as I have a key. Then I gotta close the door so I can steal our stuff. Can I steal anything here? Still have to everything is marked as steel. It really stinks. What do we got? Parts? Parts are good. Just take anything that's not nailed down. More parts. Lots of parts. Okay, that's good. stuff. Toilet. Okay. I think we're good. Thanks. You still can't have any of your stuff though, huh? Everything is steel. Hey, you the one who fixed this those radios? This is Halcyon News. Nice. We you interrupt your regularly scheduled Whenever you're free, let's have a chat. All right, let's have a chat. If you came to report the Admiral week on 6, we know. Last time well, Where is she? This girl? Is this the one? There we you go. aiming to send a message? If so, we best do it now while we still got time. Um, why will we run out of time? Me? No. But our relaying capabilities? That's on the final countdown. We're going offline in three... Two, one and a half, no, wait, I've lost track of my weeks. Maybe it was 36 or, uh, sometime dire soon. <laughs> what are you on about? Lose communication. Our primary relay station soon to be occluded by a gas giant. Happens every 40 years or thereabouts. The events forecasted to last for months, during which we'll lose signal to the station. We've got backup auxiliary relays, but the one currently in orbital range went offline some months ago. We can't spare people for routine maintenance. How are you cut off by losing one relay station? Good question. Well, we wouldn't be utterly and completely blacked out, but we'd lose the majority of our comm traffic for sure. Ships and colonies on Terra 2 need a clear line from their communications towers to the groundbreaker for the transmissions to make it through. If it's not clear, they transmit to the closest relay station, which stores the message, then passes it along when our orbits align. How about this one? The others won't be in orbital range during the occlusion event. Isn't it some law of the universe? The relay I gotta rely on is, of course, the one on the fritz. Hmm. Can't ships That they relay. can and they do. But only between ships owned by the same corporation. <laughs> no corporal authorized sending messages through a ship owned by a rival. And no corporal relay messages for the Wildcat freighters. Not without charging them more than they'll make in a single haul, anyway. That's cool. why we're the message hub. The Groundbreaker's neither corporate-owned nor board-controlled. Our comms are neutral. All right, sounds like it's time to get that back online. Yeah, I'm working on it. I finally got the chief to approve the budget for a diagnostic expedition. But allocating the personnel loss for sending a technical team to the relay station keeps getting denied by June Lay. Um, the chief. Let's see. I'm gonna be the old corporate guy here. What's in it for me? You save my comm center from chaos. I guarantee I'll get the chief to authorize some payment forms with your name on them while you're out fixing the station. All right, I could check on it for you. 
I should say no, but why not? Maybe you can figure out why it's offline. I'll send you with an equipment manual. Hopefully you'll get lucky, or I'll get my approval in time. Oh, and I'll need you to retrieve a copy of the Relay's backup data. I gotta uh. forward any messages from Earth stored in the memory. Better what do you mean? The Relay stations orbit the edge of the Halcyon system, so they tend to receive the majority of any transmissions from Earth. I'm sure the station's got a stack of junk messages just waiting for me to sort through. Alright. You just let messages from Earth sit in memory on an orbital relay? That's a good question. It's not like they're in high demand. Most tend to be adverts on new products, meaning only folks in Byzantium can afford them. Okay, we'll go. Alright, so we got that hooked up. That's a mechanical infested relay station. Alright, so let's go back to the ship. We'll bring Parvati over here in the next video. And what do we got going on over here? Oh, I have more skills and a perk once right I leveled up. I forgot about that. I will right, look at that next video too. It's in my journal. Passage to anywhere. No, we got a journal. What's in my journal? Let's do this one. We'll get this hooked up. Drinking sapphire wine. Okay. So, we'll go get Parvati in the next video and we'll take her down. Take her down to the big party place. So, if you're watching, thanks for watching. See ya.